Hello friend, welcome back. In this tutorial, we will see how you can verify the playwright locators, exclusive playwright locators in default Chrome browser. Because if you have to verify the playwright locators, not the XPath and CSS selector, if you have to verify the spatial playwright locators, then today you know like how you guys used to do because they cannot be verified directly in Chrome DevTools or in any other plugin so let's say if we have to verify suppose this locators we have to verify so if you go to chrome browser here and uh, okay we are on the right page so on the same page we are trying and here if you verify this it is showing 0 of 0 or if any change you make let's say this one it is showing 0 of 0 right because we cannot verify this here playwright locators cannot be let me just remove this p uh, we cannot verify these in DevTools because DevTools Chrome default Chrome DevTools doesn't support the playwright locators. Okay, then how we do verify them? We used to run playwright code in debug mode like this. Then the playwright window opens, and then you have to execute uh, like of course the way you debug here. Then uh, what we do we open the chrome dev tools here in this playwright window this is a playwright window which has been opened through playwright code and then we go to console here let me just clear this and zoom in here you type playwright then uh, you do uh, dollar here and here you paste this value and this is how we are able to verify one locator, one playwright locator. Isn't it a quite a lengthy process when you very if you just want to verify one playwright locator like this? So this is not finding anything, this finding one matching. Just to verify one playwright locator. Suppose tomorrow your UI got changed and without running the code or something happened, or let's say you are running your code not in debug mode normally you are running and there is a script got failed so is it really required that you run the code in debug mode then verify the selector or locators or play uh, playwright locators no that is a like quite a time consuming process this process if you have to verify let's say you have one you are writing one playwright selectors or you have written something and you want to uh, you want to verify that you have to what you have to do you have to run this code and then you execute this then you right click inspect go going console then you are typing play right here then dollar this and then you are pasting the uh, selector here it's a very very lengthy process of course like uh, it it might not take uh, maybe like not more than one minute for you but every time if you will do it will take a lot of time can't we do something like like we do for x path and selectors and immediately we are able to verify on selectors hub so yes you guys can do that just open selectors hub and here you paste the playwright selector and hit enter you would be able to verify the playwright selector just like any other x path and css selector isn't it very simple so what you have to do you have any kind of playwright locator a special playwright locator you just open selectors up paste the value there and it will you would be able to verify that how you can get the selectors hub just go to selectorshub.com and from here click on install or you can directly search on a uh, chrome store for this one or whichever browser you are using so you would be able to install selectors hub on that particular browser and from there you can uh, like install you can add it in your browser so let's say click on we want to add it on chrome so here from chrome store you would be able to add it in your browser you can follow this uh, detailed tutorial if you miss anything if you are not able to find in uh, find it in dev tools you will find it there everything is there okay now uh, let me show you guys few more examples like uh, which all kinds of playwright select locators it will support so like you have any kind of playwright locator you would be able to verify that let's say this one if we copy this if there will be any matching node it will show you if there will not be then it will show zero matching node like this it is showing zero if there are more 
matching notes it will show that one but remember you should you will have to go to that page so these locators i have written for this practice page so let us go to this practice page here this is the practice page uh, you guys can also use this practice page to practice uh, web automation or for learning purpose now go to select yourself paste this value here and you see you would be able to verify this playwright selector like above left right everything if you paste this here in dev tools you will see that it is showing zero of zero even not not even in console you would be able to verify like uh, sometimes we used to verify this way so yeah let me do this with inside double quotes you see that it is failing saying that it is an invalid xpath expression because there you can verify only xpath and css selector not the playwright locators but in selectors of you would be able to do that anything like below above left right all kinds of playwright locators can be verified here uh, something like has text as well so whatever playwright locators are there they can be verified here also like it is showing two matching nodes so you want to see that which all two matching nodes are those so that also can be seen here let me just make it out little zoom so this is the first one here you see that two matching nodes so this is the first one when you hover on the first matching node here it is showing all the matching nodes so this is the first one it is highlighting that donate if you hover on the second one it will scroll the screen and it will show the show you the another element so you see that that is at the bottom so these two elements are there on this page and this is the playwright locator for these elements so this is how you can verify playwright locators without opening the without running any code in debug mode without wasting any time just using the selector so isn't it amazing features and in fact like if you have to if you want to auto generate the playwright locators like this you can also use the uh, like this feature ha we have in selectors of pro version that you would be able to generate the playwright locators as well like let's say you want to learn more about playwright uh, locators the spacer locators or you are using playwright and then you want to automatically generate playwright locators here you see that there in selectors of pro there is a feature it generates the pw selectors and you can get it from here by default uh, you will see that it is will it will be off from here under customized settings so don't worry that if you are using playwright uh, selectors of pro and you find that oh playwright locators are not being generated so uh, don't worry just go to customize and here you just turn on this one and continue and here you now you will inspect the element and it will automatically generate the playwright locators so this is the quick video and a huge time saver selector sub is for those who are working on playwright and i'm sure like definitely selector sub will help you guys a lot to save a lot more time while writing the playwright locators or while verifying the playwright locators and as well as while generating the playwright locators with that thank you thank you so much let others know about this amazing features because many people still are not aware about that uh, they can directly verify the playwright locators selectors as well in selectors hub though this feature was there is there in selectors hub from last one year so yeah looking forward for your support guys thank you thank you so much